everyone, and welcome back to the forest. So this is going to be another multiplayer episode where I'm just messing around on mine and JD's, uh, or my and JD's multiplayer stream, just so that I can kind of get out some details because we have some new people in the subscribe section on Discord, so I kind of want to detail, like go over some of the details and stuff about that. So I am going to pop right in. Come on, start game. And then I, uh, okay, I'm going to wait until I see like Rusty or Pockery or one of them, just because I don't want to be going over the details if there's no subscribe it's here to see it okay so things are being built we have <laughs> we have all the different houses would she be upset if no we've talked about this we talked about this so JD and I have decided that she can get rid of her hut because I've built her a house so that's gonna be gown but I don't want to ah, I can't do anything Gash, ding. Okay, fine. Come over here. Turn off gameplay. Allow building destruction. Just remind me for the love of all that is holy to turn that off. going to take to destroy this thing. Ah, 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 there it goes. Okay. Well, look at that. Oh, hi, bird. Okay. So now I feel like a set of stairs is in order. I build things because <laughs> I have nothing better to do. Um... Yeah, just custom stairs. Come on. Work with me. Mm. Alright, we'll leave it there. Actually, you know what, that that looks good. That looks fine. Just opening some stuff up. Okay. Before I forget, I'm gonna turn that off. Because I have accidentally left that on before and have had some massive problems. Okay. 84! Oh, wait, that's part of. <laughs> I was like, 84? Like, I only building stairs, then I completely forgot that there's a house. Okay, so that needs seven. Yeah, I know. I know you're cold. If you had just been able to go to sleep, this wouldn't have happened. So we need, what, five? Five more? Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's see. Dry, dry. Eat that. Gonna be complaining about the cold. Um, no, I don't have that good. Oh yeah, huh? I forgot that we had a rabbit. But we have a pet. I'm going to need to restock these. Oh, there's people. Yeah, as much as I've built in in the multiplayer, oh yeah, I'd be I'd be so dead in the in the single player. I would have spawned all sorts of stuff on here. It would have been real bad. Oh. For king and country, I just need one log. Nope. Nope, I just need the one. Ha! 
<laughs> Look at that. I really feel like building a wall right there so that I, can, so that I don't fly into the water. I feel like that might actually... Because if I build stairs up here, then I could put a wall there and just like walk down. <laughs> I feel like this could be a thing. Okay, we're going to save. Still can't sleep. Then I'm out of logs. <sighs> hey, Disney! Hi, Candy! See, so yeah, Disnerd, we are um, we are going to reopen the the monthly drawing. So I was kind of waiting for Rusty. <laughs> I'm sorry, Candy. I can never tell because obviously I don't see the ads, so I can never tell like how long people are having to watch them for. But yeah, so we are reopening the monthly drawing because now that we have like Candy, Pockery, Rusty. Um, I think it could be fun. Uh, that's because you subscribed. So subscribers don't have to watch ads. Just fun fact. Okay, why is, why is this not working anymore? I swear that thing just like stopped working. Like I can't plant anything in it anymore. Do I have... I have seeds. Oh, I can't plant those seeds. Okay, well maybe if I go get a different type of seed. Okay, so there's a gap. There's a little bit of a gap. That's gonna drive me insane. But it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, Rose, not everything has to be perfect. Okay, no, 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 we're not, no. We're not doing that. Okay, custom stars. Do, 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 do. I think they're going up back that way. Don't fall off the rock. Mm. Except I still need to build the wall right there because I, like I said, I'm really sick and tired of flying off the edge into the water. Hi, Candy. Now that you're officially, officially here. Dang it. I, I just want to sleep. <laughs> the game's like, no, you can't sleep yet. Oh, yeah. Hi. I forgot that I put the targets out there. A little, little target practice. Are there really only four of them? I think there are. Huh. Interesting. Oh, wait, no, there's five. There's one right there. I keep building things when I have other stuff to do. The game looks fun when you're not in single player. Because single player is when everything goes wrong. Uh, I think I actually did... I think it was, like, what, two days ago? Three days ago? I did a single player episode. And man, oh man. Also, you have to get used to cannibals trying to kill you. That was uh, absolutely terrifying. Okay, whose sled is... Whose sled is where? Because this is JD's sled. Did I take my sled all the way over there? I think I did. That's the... I am the queen of flipping sleds and not being able to flip them back. Also, if you're gonna run out in the wild, bring an axe. Always bring an axe. Okay, well, I need, I need 10 logs, so I'm gonna come up here. Paranoid check the forest, just in case. This is the forest, so pretty much you crash land on this island that's absolutely full of cannibals. You have a son that you're supposed to be finding, even though I got an achievement for doing 
everything but finding my son. And I pretty much use this as like building simulator because that's what I like to do. I like to build. So I build. <laughs> oh no! 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 I just threw myself off the cliff. Oh no! No, I'm stuck! No! How did this happen? Oh boy. Um, let me out! Let me out! What? <laughs> Gosh dang it. Can I? Can I? How do I crouch? Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. I was like, no! I was like, I'm gonna have to quit that whole thing! We're good. Yeah, this is my multiplayer server with my friend JD. And in multiplayer, it's... Uh, I don't know why I feel safer, but also, if I build ridiculous things like I do now, I'm not going to spawn any, like, huge monsters on me. Also, hey, Rusty! I see you. Okay, um, Rusty, now that you're here, I can go and talk about the monthly drawing. So, a while back, I started with my subscribers a monthly drawing where the winner got to pick between a bypass card or a, um, they got to pick, like, play a live stream with me if they wanted. So, we are going back to monthly drawings, now that there's more of you. And to earn points, because it's points based, to earn points you can get attendance points by showing up to streams. So like starting in November, all of you guys who decided to be a part of the drawing, because you don't have to be, but if you let me know that you want to be part of the drawing, you, um, you can get attendance points by showing up, which means you show up to a stream and you comment. Um, and then it's like, oh, okay, I know you're here. Points for you. Um, if you notice in the point section, I did add a, uh, a bonus point. So you can buy a bonus point for 5,000 Twitch points. So that's just like a, a redemption sort of thing. You can redeem an extra bonus point. <laughs> okay, it doesn't start till the first, because it's not. It wouldn't be this month's drawing. It would be next month's drawing because we're just starting, and it's almost next month anyway. So, yeah, starting on November first, and you have to let me know that you want to be a part of the drawing. So, in the private subscribe chat on Discord. Just let me know that you want to be a part of the monthly drawing, and I will get you written down. Because I have to keep track of the points. So, yeah, just uh, let me know. But yeah, so... The, uh, the... Words, words rose. I woke up at five this morning and I didn't go back to sleep. Oh, I forgot there's no wall. And there we go! I just launch myself. Yes, the uh what you can redeem your your win for is like I said, you can either do a live stream with me, if that's what you wish, or you can get a bypass card. Um Disnerd, was there any other perks last time? I can't remember, it's been a while since we did a drawing. They sort of went out of fashion, but let me know because the Swiss cheese is having a very difficult time this morning. I'm pretty sure that was it. No, why do I need so many logs? How many do? I, how many more do I need? I need two more. <coughs> I'm like this. It's not even going to be a finished project because I really need to start working on that uh, cabin I have out there. But I still need, what, 77 logs for? I am super paranoid when I play this game. I'm like, what? What was that? What was the noise? This is what happens when you've been attacked by cannibals a time or two. Every time I say something like that, I feel like 
the, uh, I think it's, what is it, farmers? We know a thing or two because we've seen a thing or two. <laughs> That's me when I play this game. I'm like, oh, be careful of, like, this area right here. It's like, oh, how do you know that? Because <laughs> bad things have happened to me. The last episode was crazy, though, because when I ended up in that cave and they, like, the blue, the blue cannibals just kept, like, popping out of freaking nowhere, scaring the ever-loving daylights out of me. It was no bueno. I, uh, I did not enjoy that. Okay, so now we have this platform, so you can just walk down nicely. Oh, that, that gap's gonna bug me. It's fine, Rose. It's fine. Okay, now I just need a wall right here so that we don't go flying off into the lake every time. But, I'm not gonna focus on that right now. I am going to go build a cabin. And possibly do some hunting. I need to refill these two. Because the whole point was to have logs in case of an emergency, and then I keep using them for non-emergency situations. Okay, let's... Okay, let's store our energy for a little bit, just, just in case. Um, berries for breakfast. Okay. Right. I, like, I don't want to run into a cannibal if I can't run away. So there's the house. We are going to build a fortress over there. But for now... Okay, we're just gonna, just gonna run over there just to be safe. JD just comes back to the multiplayer and I keep building random crap that I probably shouldn't be building, but I do it anyway. Ah, okay. So it's just a little, just a little loneliness perch. Oh. oh, I am glad I'm on my perch. Oh boy. Oh, dang it, I missed. I, like, went over his shoulder. Dang it! I'm not used to the modern bow. I haven't quite gotten a hang of the aim, and I am losing arrows like you wouldn't believe. Okay, headshot there. Oh, direct to the chest. Okay, there's another guy who is where? Bro, I know you're down there. See this? Oh, there. Oh, headshot. Nice. Okay. Now we equip the axe. <clears throat> Okay. I just want the arrow. And I like to keep things tidy. So, the problem is, is I'm used to the other bow, and the modern bow has a different aiming. Like, it's, its hitbox is a little different. So, I have not practiced with the modern bow very often. Because I think JD and I just got that not too uh, not too long ago. Just a pile of corpses. Okay, there we go. Let this be a wo oh gosh dang it. <sighs> Are there always cannibals ruining my good day? Climb, boy, climb! Okay, well, they seem to be going down the other side of the beach, so I am just going to save this. But yeah, so this is the crafted bow versus the modern bow, and the crafted bow, you use the, uh, 
the notch in the bow to aim and it's a lot easier. I also have a chainsaw which makes things a lot easier. But for now... Okay. Yeah, it looks like they went down the other side. So it should be good for now. Just uh, gotta, gotta be on the lookout. I think there's like one, one bad part of the game. If there weren't so many freaking cannibals, I would love this game so much more. What what's with the screaming? Did I miss something? I don't think I missed anything. Oh, that was almost bad. I'm trying to watch out for the sled. Because if I flip another one, I'm gonna be pissed. Because they have not seemed to be able to get rid of the ones that I've broken. Ah, okay, I see. I don't even know why I keep building more houses. <laughs> Do I need them? No. But for some odd reason, I just keep... I just keep building because I think it's fun. Also, I'm just reminded that in one of the episodes, I killed a lizard with a tree. Dropped it right on the little guy's head. Unintentional. Didn't even know it was there. But yeah, so if you want to take part in the drawing, just uh, let me know in the subscribe chat. I will get you added down. I want to like, I actually want to get like a board or something, like a like a dry erase board or something. That way I can keep track of it in a slightly more fun way because I just keep putting it on like papers. So I just have all these like little slips of papers with tally marks on them. I'm like, mm. like tally marks is a little boring. How is everyone's morning going? Also, Rusty, so the bypass card, yeah, you get to pick what game you want for the day. And if you would like to do a, a stream together, just let me know. I'm not against the idea. In fact, I've actually been enjoying all the, uh, the multiplayers that I've been doing lately. Hi, Rabbit. Just checking the surroundings. Oh, shoot. Well, this is a problem. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to get up here and up on top of the platform before... I get eaten. No, 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 no. Oh no. Oh, is like is he breaking it? Just go away. There's one. They do tend to scatter. I don't hear anybody else. <gasps> I guess I don't see anybody else. Jeez. In the hierarchy of cannibals, these ones are prob- well, no, okay, so the giant blue ones are my least favorite. But these guys are uh, pretty high up there. Just because they're very, they're very erratic and it's very hard to, uh, it's very hard to tell what they're going to do next. So it's like, whenever they scatter like that, I'm like, are they, are they, are they going to come back? Yeah, because I'm pretty much free today. 
Except, so I try not to stream when my husband comes home, just because that's time for us to be together. So n we can do my normal stream time, which would be, I think, 5 o'clock for you. I, I would not mind. Although, then again, you just don't want to do fast by yourself, which I find to be hilarious, because I've been playing solo fast for a while now. See? Look, he came back. Just walk away. See, so long as they don't bug me, I don't bug them. Like, it is not my desire to end up in combat situations. It just happens. That's it. Just walk away. happening no no I did it again uh. Uh. no I'm so mad why oh gosh dang it uh. will you please let me break this Hear it chopping. Please. I can't handle another pink flag mocking me in the distance. Do I need to get out the chainsaw? I will get out the chainsaw if I have to. With a chainsaw! Oh my gosh. Oh my dear sweet lord of all that is holy. I can't! I can't with this. Ah. A moment of silence for the dearly departed. Okay, Disney, I very much appreciate that, but problem is, is I've tried that. I've tried it, and it hasn't worked for me yet. Why did it just now decide to work? I literally tried that, like the first couple times it happened. This is not my first rodeo with flipping the cart. The last time, it wouldn't let me do it. Ask JD. I've been mourning the loss of that freaking sled for very, <laughs> for like months now. Literally, I have tried everything with this sled, and this sled will not let me. I swear by the love of all that is holy, if it lets me do it now. Oh my gosh! Why is it letting me do it now? I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. That's it. I'm going home. I don't have to take this anymore. <laughs> you know, I kind of miss smacking face first into the cabin. Those were good times. I'm so mad now. I, I'm not kidding. Even JD tried it, and she could not get a hold of the handle. Yay! Cheering for... I'm not even going to call that my own stupidity, because of the fact that, like I said, it wouldn't do it for me. 
It like straight up refused to do it. So, yeah. I, I don't count that. That's not a stupid moment. That's the game being stupid. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm definitely not short on carts now. You know, I wish there was a way that you could, like, climb up the, uh... The zip lines, because, you know, sometimes, sometimes if I can't sleep and I still don't want to go out in the middle of the night, I just, I don't want to sit at home. You know, sometimes I want to be in other places. I like this one because I can watch across the lake and see if there's uh, cannibals running through the forest. I've seen it a couple times. Or I'll just be like perched up here and then all of a sudden you just see like lights or something. Look at that moon. The moon rises really fast in this game. Look at all the crap that I've built. The funny thing is, is aside from that cabin and the couch and I think the platform, like that front platform, I've built all of this. <laughs> JD's the one who's... She's the brave lass who goes and does caves and stuff like that, and I'm like, no, no, I'll just stay home and build things. I'm like so mad now that the freaking thing it didn't want to work. Because I've tried. I've tried so many times that it just hasn't worked for me, and then all of a sudden it decides it wants to work. Have you ever had, like, a computer issue or something, and you're like, you go through every single process trying to fix it, and you look up all the answers, and you're like, Google's telling me to do this, and it doesn't seem to want to work, and then as soon as you ask somebody to come over and look at it, it starts working like that? That's how I am for my husband. Anytime he's trying to work on something- oh, 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 see, see, lights in the distance. But every time he's trying to fix something- like the printer, his computer, whatnot. Every time he tries and he can't do it, as soon as I walk in the room, poof, it's magically fixed. But apparently the cart, uh, the cart didn't want to work with me, okay? I have too many houses. All the green ones are tree houses, and then there's our two homes there. See, and JD marked the caves because she's smart, and I'm over here just like, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, well, down we go. For a second I thought there was a cannibal standing there, I was like, oh no! But it's a good thing I was wrong. Oh yeah, huh. Oh. Straight into the water. Yeah, and it's hilarious. Like, he'll be sitting there for like half an hour just like going, it's not working. And he'll sit there and he'll whine and complain and he'll get so mad that it's not working for him. And then all of a sudden I walk up to it and all of a sudden it's just like, we're working again. <laughs> he gets so mad. He's like, He's like, what the heck did you do? I was like, I didn't even do anything. I didn't even touch anything. JD hasn't even seen her house yet. Like, I'm kind of excited for her to see her house because I worked very hard on this. You know what? She needs a planter. I've just decided. I'm, I'm going to spruce up her house a little bit more. Because <laughs> I have nothing better to do. And she's JD. She's my bestie. She deserves the best. In a little planter box. I don't want to do it over the bed. We'll just do it right here. I was gonna say I only have like 20 sticks in my inventory. And since I can't sleep, what else am I gonna do besides get more sticks? I know, I know, you're cold. You sound like my husband. He has been belly aching so much because it finally started to get cold. And he's just like, 
walking around all the time going, I'm so cold. I like it's not even bad. Like, I was walking around in 29 degree weather this morning, just like, eh. Like, oh look, it's a, it's, a, it's a chill in the air. And he's just like literally like freezing. And then he turns up the heater like super high and I'm just like, what is your deal? He's like, I'm cold. I'm like, put on more clothes. Like it's, to me, I'm hot. I'm like, it's too hot in here. And he's like, what are you talking about? I'm like, it's hot. Like, like I don't like the warm weather. So I'm just basking in the, in the cold. And he's just all like, eh. Great, he's gonna end up freezing to death. Come on. Just once more in the water. I really need that wall. Yes, yes, that is that is one time that I definitely sound like mother is just uh Well, okay. The thing is, if I'm in tank tops and a short uh, and like short shorts, I should not be expected to like be nude in the house if I don't wish to be. Simply for the fact that he wants to wear shorts and a t-shirt and complain that he's cold. It's just, that's not how it works. Uh, no. The red flashy thing is my stomach. Because I'm starving, apparently. Because I can't sleep! <laughs> if I was sleeping, I would just wake up and eat. But they're just like, no. Okay, so now that we're warm... I'm go finish JD's house. Because this is what I do. I just, I build houses. There we go. See, she's got such a nice little house now. Like, I I love what I do. <laughs> I love building houses. If they made, like, a massive update and just added, like, way more things to build, like, oh my gosh, I'd be in heaven. So there's a, there's like a timer thing. And it won't let you sleep if, like, I don't even know. I don't even know, like, when you're technically allowed to sleep. But now I've slept because I'm a pansy and I don't do anything in this game during hours of, uh, of darkness. It's just, uh, I can't do it. Occasionally I will roam from, like, perch to perch, but that's just, uh, that's just about it. I need to go hunting, like, stat. No, I hit its butt. <laughs> I'm not the best at hunting, especially since I decided to try to use a slingshot. Because I'm not the best at aiming with said slingshot, especially at distance. Nope. What the heck? I swear, as soon as I get on stream, like, I can't do anything. Like, the other day I was hunting with JD, and it was like every five seconds I was, like, bringing something in, and she's just like, how do you do that? Oh my gosh, why? Yeah, because I was joking around because she was having a hard time hunting and I was like, I already filled up the, the drying racks. Also, I'm like trying to figure out, am I, am I doing double arrows again? One of my bows is glitched where it draws double arrows. Uh, and I, I hate wasting the pelts, but... Is there a rabbit in there? There is a rabbit in there. Okay, I'll, I'll bring that back with me. Not as a food rabbit, but as a, uh, a house rabbit. If only I could get some lizards. Fish would be nice too, but... Okay, so now... <sighs> okay, I'm gonna try again with the slingshot because I don't want to keep wasting arrows if I don't need to. 
So walk slow and hopefully we can find some lizards. Also, part of me has a morbid curiosity, and I want to destroy one of the effigies, but I know that that is bad news bears, and I don't want to do it. But I want to do it. What is that? Oh, it's Target. I was like, what the heck is that over there? It's like one of those invasive thoughts, like, I know I shouldn't do it, but my brain's just like, you want to do it. And I'm like, mm. Like, bad things are going to happen, but they're like, you don't know exactly what's going to happen. Can we vote on destroying an effigy? Probably not, because you guys are going to make me do it, and that bad, bad things are going to happen, and I really don't. This, maybe if I was in single player, but this is my multiplayer with JD, and I don't want to ruin everything just because I got curious. Like I said, maybe if it was in single player, but since this is not only my world, I don't I don't want to ruin it for JD. Even though I play on it without her, I, I try to keep things um I try to keep things as good and as positive as I can. So I, I try to only influence this world for the better. one lizard. Okay, I'm going to put these on the drying rack. And honestly, like, I don't know what would happen. All I know is it's bad. I think it, like, summons, like, a massive group of cannibals onto your position. And that's kind of the last thing I want to do, especially with all the stuff that's around here. I already lost one cabin to cannibals, and that was really unfortunate. And that actually made me cry, so. I built a cabin way, way, way over there where the other flag is. And, yeah, unfortunately I built it in, like, the biggest hot spot in the area. And then there was a giant mutant, and it came and wrecked the cabin with JD and I inside the cabin. It was not a good day. <laughs> okay, do I have any more? Nope, I don't have any Ah, dang it. I should make another one. I really should, because I have, I have way too many pelts. But it's... Oh, I could just put some on JD's. Oh, does she actually have those organized? Probably not, knowing JD. I don't think JD believes in organization like I do. Sorry, my mom's texting me. But yeah, I'm like, I have this morbid curiosity, but that can only mean bad things. JD did warn me about it, and so that's why we've been, like, super careful, like, if we're felling a tree or something, to avoid them. Because, yeah, I don't know exactly what would happen, but I've heard bad things. Dang it. No, no we will not... I will not be enticed by the curiosity. Not this time. I say to convince myself more than anybody else. <laughs> I would say, unfortunately, my curiosity is one of the things that gets me in trouble the most. Because I want to know. Like, I, I hate not knowing. But if bad things are going to happen, I don't want to do that. I can hear- I can hear JD's voice in my head going, Don't do it, Rose!
You know, I keep I keep making my own like commandments, and one of them should be, "Thou shalt not text thy mother when you're standing in the middle of the forest unpaused." That's how death happens. Also, JD would be livid if she saw all these stumps. You know, I do love her to pieces, but sometimes I deliberately drive her crazy. And I tell her, look JD, I can clean up after myself, I promise. Okay, that one's glitched. That one's good. That one's good. How many stumps have I created here? Okay, that's that's a glitchy one. Okie dokie. remember sometimes which ones are the stick trees and which ones are the actual log trees. Okay, JD is the queen of chaos. But certain things, certain- oh jeez, I thought the lizard was a cannibal. <laughs> I have had to attack the cannibals with the chainsaw before and it's, it's um, an experience. It's funny because JD's OCD is kind of like opposite of mine. Like, she likes to redecorate everything and put things in random places, and she gets like freaked out about me having stumps all over the place, but. I'm like, no, everything has to have its proper place, and I'm the one who leaves stumps everywhere. <laughs> Although, technically speaking, that is where they should be. And no, I will be her. I don't, I don't want to cause her distress if I don't have to. I'm all for a bit of light teasing. Nothing that's actually going to drive her to insanity. Because there's been times that she will, like, go out in the dark and sit there and try to get rid of my stumps. For some odd reason, the, the stumps just, uh... What did I eat? What the... F what just happened? Apparently I ate something that hurt me. Oops. Um, I don't know what I did, but apparently I was wrong. Uh, because I can. Because apparently I have an addiction to building houses and I can't be stopped. I really have no good reason, except for I wanted to build a fortress on top of this hill. So I'm going to build, like, um, I'm going to build around it and sort of give myself, like, a wall of safety. And I just, uh, I wanted a fortress on the hill. Because I have very poor planning skills. Only 50 logs to go. I always pick the projects that take like an eternity. <laughs> I don't make much sense. But I have fun with it. At some point, I should try to find my son, but... Timmy's got a new life with cannibals. Although at this point, JD and I can't figure out whose son it is, if it's my son or if it's her son, so he's our son. And, you know, if, uh... She can't really call me a bad parent, because she hasn't been looking for him either, so... Yeah, I I love games with building. Like, base building is my thing. I absolutely adore it. I went 
absolutely ham in Fallout 4. Like, some of my settlements are massive. I actually kind of sort of broke the game a little bit because I built too much. And they're like, um, we can't handle the graphics of this. And I'm like, yes, you can. You can and you will. I pissed off the game. And you know what? It was kind of fun doing it. And I do have a Minecraft house that took me th about three weeks, like three real weeks, to complete. And yeah, it's massive, except for the fact that it's Minecraft and there's not a whole lot of extra things to do. So I, yeah, it's just kind of there. I'm like, look at my giant house. I only filled like four rooms of it. Uh, Sims? For me, building houses in The Sims is, like, it was really fun when I was a kid, except for the fact that everything was just a very large box, and I was very bad at it. But, like, now, I will look up blueprints and stuff, which is how I did my uh, Minecraft house. I will look up blueprints and schematics and actually, like, build a house based off of that. To me, that's more fun. I cannot, like, freehand a house in The Sims. I really can't. Or it's... I, I don't want to take the creative effort to do it, because it just seems like it would take way too long. I'm like, eh. Eh. I, I can't be bothered. I do enjoy a good round of The Sims, though, except I don't play it too often anymore, at least. Okay, everyone keep keep an eye out for the cannibals for me, because they living dangerously. Okay. Do -do -do. Should probably like, drink some water or something, but like eh. 37 logs to go! I'm getting there. Yeah, and also, like, when I play The Sims, I prefer to play, like, the original Sims. If my if my other computer actually wanted to work with me with it, I would do... I, I had a lot of fun with The Sims 3, but Sims 3 gets a little overwhelming because there's almost too much to do. And like, <laughs> I hated that there was no skill cheat in that game because it it drove me crazy. Because there's too many skills. There are way too many skills to master in The Sims 3. And for me, the way that I, I don't I don't play Sims like you're supposed to. Like you hear people, you know, oh I'm a legacy simmer, and I kind of am. But I always keep the first family like alive and young. So, it's weird because you could have, like, six generations, but the grandparents are still, like, young adults. I blame when- I blame that on the fact that when I was a kid, I just- I- I spent a lot of time building my sins, and I didn't want to lose them. I am stupidly sentimental. Ask my husband. We're on a- I'm on a Doctor Who kick because of him, and yeah, it's it's <laughs> led to some interesting places in my life. Because my brain won't stop you know, braining. My creativity gets me into trouble. Uh, I hate when there's like one log left, but I don't want to like leave it there in case I forget where it is. So then I just have to take the single log all the way down. I kind of want to build like a an awning sort of situation. Also, I have no idea how I'm going to get into the house. I haven't I haven't thought that far. 
I should probably be thinking of a way <laughs> to get into this. Uh... This is why I need JD. <laughs> because JD helps me make sense of my brain. Okay. It's amazing how much faster you can build when you have a chainsaw. Twenty-four! This is Oh shoot. Keep running. We're just gonna go down the hill with those. Okay, I think I can safely drop it in the forest. I think they ran. I'm close enough to that perch that I can jump up if I definitely went the wrong way with that tree, but it's, uh, it's okay. What is the channel? The, the words of the channel? It's fine. <laughs> okay. Have a good one, Disner. Thank you for joining us. bothered with anything else. Chains are nothing. Perfect. So many stumps. see that. I'm not blind. Climb the tree! Climb the tree! Climb the tree! Whew. Oh, it's a white one. Those guys are bad news. They are strong. Whew. Okay. Well. I hate when they do that. When they just like disappear. Because I'm like, I'm just expecting them to pop up out of nowhere. Also, you know, I love how you can set a fire on top of the platform and be totally fine. I'm running out of blueberries. Oh, yep, see, look, there he is. <gasps> yeah. No! No! Get back up! Get back up! Ooh! <gasps> no! No! Not happening! you not happening I'm not dealing with the tree climbers again why oh, heck no I've been there I've done that I don't want the t-shirt and I still can't sleep <sighs> well then oh look there's more because when it rains, it pours. Oh, except he uh, didn't even notice me. And he appears to be a solo. 
interesting. I don't normally run into the light guys whenever they're by themselves, but whatever works except now I'm stuck in a tree although that, that was the tree's purpose this that's why I put started putting tree houses everywhere <laughs> are you trying to go for 5,000 so you can get a, a bonus point or are you trying to be in competition with uh, JD who said that she wants to save a million points Okay, another li Oh, he's got a pack with him. It's okay. They don't notice the fire in the trees. No one no one needs to know I'm here. Ugh, still can't sleep. I really just need to build the wall and make my fortress just so that I can have like a, a bigger spot to just like run into. I still haven't figured exactly how I'm going to do that. Oh, there's another guy. Oh, there's a bunch of guys. Oh, I've been spotted. I hate the noises. These are the guys that wear like the masks. You're dead. You're coming towards me. And you ran past, that's fine. Okay. Kind of just want to take a look. So I think what I'm going to do... Okay, I think I'm going to build a rock wall... Because I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired of cutting trees down. <laughs> I'm really tired. So, yeah, I think we're going to do that. Except...